Rusty told the driver all about the plan. And that night, he came back to the shed. The manager says he'll make a home for a Bluebell engine if you find one. Right, said Rusty. We'll find one tomorrow. It took them all of the next day to travel to the other railway. Darkness fell and the cold wind blew. Ooh, what's that? murmured Rusty. But it was only the sounds of the lonely scrapyard. Diesels, silent and still, lined up on guard. Who are you? Rusty plucked up courage. I'm a shed and sidings inspection, Diesel. Have you any engines in the shed? No, no. Rusty rallied again. Then, er, uh, what about the sidings? One. We have one. Rusty grew braver still. Then I'll just go and inspect. A small engine with a tall funnel stood sad and alone in the shadowy siding. His driver was huddled in the cab, keeping him company. Excuse me, said Rusty. Do you like bluebells? The engine looked startled. Yes, bluebells are beautiful. Then you're soon going to see lots of them because I'm getting you out of here. Rusty's engineer agreed to be Stepney's fireman. So off they set, past the bleak and brooding line of diesels. Where is he going? They hissed. Just down the line, replied Rusty. And they chuffed quickly away. We've done it. We're over the border and back on our own railway. Mission accomplished. Thank you.